Hello everyone, today I'm going to do a quick unboxing of my new bass amp. This one is the Bugera, not the tube version, but the MOSFET version of their new Class D amp. I purchased it online for $3.99. Um, I purchased it to replace my Harky HA5500, which died on me. So this was what I upgraded to. I did a lot of reviews, I did a lot of uh, research on it first, and I decided to go with this one. So let's go ahead and see what's on the front and the back of the box first, and then we're going to open it up and see what's inside. Right here on the front, you got a nice picture of the amp itself. Um, it's a ultra compact 2000 watt class D bass amplifier with MOSFET preamp compressor and dynamizer technology then it's a Bulgaro flip it over to the back you got a picture of the uh, back of the amp and that's pretty much all to it on the outside of the box anyways All right, let's go ahead and open it up and see what's inside. Okay, once inside, we have the user manual. Of course, we got the protection to keep the amp safe during shipping. have our power cable and here she is I believe this amp is on the seven pounds so that's a big upgrade for me because my Harky amp was a lot heavier maybe 20 30 pounds probably more than that it was a pretty heavy amp but um, to go from that to a seven pound is definitely a big plus all right so let me go ahead and get this out the plastic all right well here she is let's go ahead and bring this a little closer here she is very lightweight and portable easy to carry one hand throw it in your backpack or your gig bag or whatever and go let's go ahead and try to take a closer look at it of course we got the Bugera logo here in the front it say Veron MOSFET here um, and then we have our input right here let me see if I can get a better angle we have our input right here we have our mute button uh, slash clip so I'm guessing that lights up once it start uh, clipping beside that we have our negative 15 DB button here we have our gain we have our compressor compressor uh, let's say thresh on the top and compressor on the bottom that's the button for that um, then you have a uh, I guess you can control either or and then you have your compression knob right here then you have your ultra low, you have your bass, mid, and you got mid frequency, which you can adjust it. Uh, it looked like it says uh, 220, 450, 800, 1.6K, and 3K. And then of course, last but, last but not least, you have your treble, then you have your ultra high, and then you have your master volume right here. You got your fan on the side and then let's check out the back of course you got your power right here you got your on and off switch here um, you have your two speaker on connectors you have um, an input for phones effects loop auxiliary in tuner out um, and then you have uh, right here it says send preamp out and then return amp in 
uh, of course, like I said, auxiliary in, foot switch, and then uh, it say mute down here. It say tip mute ring effects, and then um, over here you have a direct out section. You got your ground lift, and then you got your EQ post or pre, and then you have your level for your mic or line. That's pretty much all with that. And then, like I said, of course, you got your handle right here, so it's easy to carry. And then you got your ventilation right here. So, so far, I mean, this is definitely a nice looking amp. Um, it looks premium. It don't look cheap at all. It feels good in the hand. Now, I'm going to go ahead and hook it up and uh, see how it sounds. Thank you guys for checking out this unboxing. Please like and subscribe, and there's more videos to come.